Um, what famous woman do you think should get the Hamilton musical treatment? Ham See, I haven't, and I haven't seen Hamilton yet. I was thinking that Betsy Ross should get the Hamilton treatment. <laughs> And I don't know why that cracks me up, but I would totally go, I would totally go see that. <laughs> but I was thinking Amelia Earhart. You can have planes flying in the audience. That would be cool. <laughs> All right, you, are, you get to spend the day with Beyonce. Mm -hmm. well, what would you do? I've been thinking and thinking because you'd want to just live her life. I feel like no activity that I would plan would be worthy of her time. I thought road trip with Beyonce, but that is more than a day. I really love to do karaoke, and I think it would be fun to do karaoke with Beyonce. It's a sneaky way to get her to sing for you. <laughs> And then I thought like, oh, like we could be beekeepers maybe, like collect honey. <laughs> what is the one movie, like a guilty pleasure movie that when it's on, you can't turn it off? This is not, I don't think of this as guilty pleasure. This is just like uh, one of my favorite movies, but I will never turn it off. It's almost famous. I say Grace. But I had like a big crush on Danny Zuko when I was little. When Michael and Garano, when she is telling him how old he really is and he goes, Eleven! and like screams it in the car. Like it makes me laugh so much. So I'd watch the movie and I would have, I would do the costume changes with Sandy. So like each scene I would have, have to pause it and then dress up and then look at the screen and then I would say the lines and act it out just by myself. I don't know why, it just puts me in a like very calm mood. So I always finish it even if it's late at night, I always finish it because I love it.